Welcome back, Internet. I am playing Expedition Antarctica, and this time I'm going to be traveling from Base Camp 1 to Base Camp 2. Let's see if I can do it. I hope I can. A couple shout-outs really quick from YouTube. Midnight Fox, Ricardo Milos, uh, Lucio Plays, and Gerald Punctuel. Gerald Punctuel. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's cool. Um, and also, yesterday I missed somebody that was in game with me, and I forgot to mention you. Uh, Kamada TDM. I apologize. I totally missed it. I totally missed it. My bad. So let's get on with the game. I gotta get mounted. I gotta get geared up here, and I gotta get uh, traveling the Antarctic waste because it's really cold, and I gotta get to base camp two, and I, I wanna get there quick. I don't wanna dilly dally around. I wanna get there because it is cold, and I know there's gonna be snow, storm, and blizzards and all kinds of crazy crap going on uh, so let's do this huh internet let's do this okay so a couple days when I was playing this game for the very first time I played it as a Canadian that was because it was Canada Day Canada Day I think was actually the day before I played the, this game the first time but because I love Canada, actually I love all na all countries around the world. Everybody has got something interesting, an interesting culture, something going on for them, a history, whatever it may be, good, bad. We all come from different places. We gotta uh, respect all that and learn from each other. But Canada, I live in the United States. Canada is just north of where I live, not too far, maybe four or five hours away. I've been to Canada many times and I love Canada. So because it was Canada today, last time I played as a Canadian. This time I am playing um, as an, uh, uh, from the United States. That's what the flag is there on my character. And I actually am from the United States. I live in the Midwest. In case you guys didn't know that, Osgard Yorkipoo is from the Midwest of the United States of America. So here we go. Let's do it. And already I can feel my quads burning from climbing up this hill, man. Like, you know, dude. Okay, maybe not. It's just a video game. But if this is real and I was really climbing up and down these hills, I can tell you what. My legs would be burning. I'd be like, oh, I need a break. I need a candy bar. I need some, I need a hamburger or something. Come on. You guys hear that wind blow? The wind blows, doesn't it, but it just doesn't blow. It also sucks. Sometimes the wind can just be blowing so hard, it sucks because it makes it really cold. Colder when the, when the wind is blowing really hard. Okay, so a really quick note here. If you haven't, like and subscribe. And also, some news. I've been asked quite a few times now to do a question and answer video. I really don't have that many subscribers. The channel is just a little bit over a month old right now. Um, and I got, I think last, when I last looked, I had like 560 subscribers on YouTube. Not bad for a channel that's only been around for about six, five, six weeks. Anyway, people have been asking me to do a question and answer video, so I decided I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I don't know when. It's going to be soon, probably in the next week or two, but I want to collect questions. So if you're watching this video, and I hope you are because you're listening to this, and you're going to hopefully in the comment section below in this video ask me some questions what do you want to know I'm not saying I'm gonna answer all the questions because some of them I might not be able to answer but if you got a good question I'm gonna do my best to and do a question and answer video so ask away whatever you want to ask me you can ask me and I'll do my best to tell you but I can't guarantee you that I'll answer every question some things are just personal Am I right? I mean, you can't, you know, like if you ask me, you know, what do I like, um, is, do I like my wife's haircut? I mean, I'm going to say yes, right? I'm going to say yes, because if I said no and she watched this video, she'd be really pissed at me. So, some things I can't answer truthfully, because if I did, it might get me in trouble with the wife. <laughs> So yeah, if you got a question, go ahead and ask. And before you ask me how old I am, I've said it many a times in many a videos, I am 46 years old. I am not a young person. I do like playing video games. I've been playing video games um, since like 1980. And I love playing video games. And I recently discovered Roblox because a member of my family said, Hey, you should play Roblox. I think you'd like it. And they were right. I did. And now I play it like all the time. And I don't play a lot of my other video games nearly as much. So, But yeah, you don't have to ask me how old I am because I am 46. 
I gotta tell you, I really like the snow effect. What I can see, and it's not a blizzard, and it's just lightly gentle snow falling. Ah, it reminds me of winter here in the Midwest of the United States. A nice, cold, crisp winter day with a gentle snowfall. Ah, yeah. Okay, so as I'm playing this game, I'm about five minutes into it or something, and I'm kind of confused because the last week, whenever I played a Roblox game, I always had a bunch of group followers and subscribers on YouTube join me in game and we'd hang out and play. There is nobody from the group and nobody from the YouTube channel who's joined me in game so far, and it's just kind of weird. I don't know what's going on. But uh, no one's here to cheer me on and, and to talk back and forth with. That's kind of sad. I like it when, when the followers, group followers and the YouTube subscribers are in-game. That's I, I like that. I want to do a lot of that. So, yes, if you are on Roblox and you see me in-game and you want to join me in-game, by all means, join me in-game. There might be a few instances where you're not able to because I have my permission thing locked off because I'm trying to do something with maybe family members. But like 90% of the time, if you see me in-game, you should be able to hopefully join me in-game as long as there's room in the game for you to join. And that's awesome because I love... And whenever uh, followers and YouTube subscribers join me in-game, I always try to do shout-outs to them in the video. Um, and so I, I know sometimes I, I miss a few here and there and I apologize, but I, I do my best to try and uh, give that recognition to any of the people who are in-game with me who are followers and subscribers. Great, I'm in an avalanche area again. That totally sucks. Oh well, gotta keep going forward, right internet? Damn right. Okay, so full disclosure here, I, I played this game like once before, maybe 15 minutes ago, and I got to this icy bridge and I died, okay, and I got to thinking I was doing something wrong, so I kind of, I got to wondering if I could just go around it, because everybody, I, I was watching other people die here, that didn't seem right, but you can go around this icy bridge. Okay, so let's wander around this thing. I'm not gonna dare go across that bridge again, man, because it totally blows. So forget that. I'm gonna go around it. Ha ha ha. Take that bridge! Take that! Ha ha! Okay, I'm kind of afraid I might slip and fall or I might get blocked, but it uh, doesn't appear that's happening. It is going to work. I'm able to go around it. And I guess that's probably the way you're supposed to handle this thing is not go on it, just go around it. Yippee! Back on the trail. Awesome. Okay, let's keep going. Keep moving on. Moving, moving, moving on. Got to keep going and going and moving. Cool, that other player there, Puppy Lover, has a really awesome uh, little pet on her shoulder. That's pretty cool. Dude, I think I want to get a little pet for my shoulder. I wonder what... I gotta look at that. That's one thing I haven't really done much of here playing Roblox. I haven't looked at the clothes. I haven't looked at the accessories and things like that. I, re I really haven't dug into that. And I'm kind of a plain dressed character. But that's how I am in real life, though, too. I mean, I, I wear jeans, I wear a shirt, I wear a jacket. I'm not, you know, I'm not out pushing the, 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 the boundaries of style. I'm pretty laid back. I'm pretty retro, let's put it that way, the way I dress <laughs> in real life. <laughs> But there is one thing that I do have in common with my avatar, Oscar Dorky Poo. He has some killer sideburns, and so do I in real life. I have sideburns. I love sideburns. <laughs> yeah, my wife hates them, but I don't care. That's her problem. 
take that wifey poo. I don't care if you don't like my sideburns. Because I like them and that's what's important. Ha ha ha. But of course, if she was to watch this video and heard me singing that, uh... The song I just sung, I'd probably get yelled at. She'd be like, what are you doing? You're teasing me in your video. That's not nice. And... Yeah, she wouldn't care. She'd probably just laugh at me and call me lame. And then I'd laugh at her and say, I love you. And she'd be like, I love you too. <laughs> Actually, you know what's funny? Today is my wedding anniversary. That's right. Me and the wife got married today. Many, many years ago. Oh, I hope you guys mind that I didn't really do any editing in this video. I pretty much just recorded it from almost beginning all the way to the end. That I didn't do any, you know, different angles and different sweeps and clips and cuts and things i just went just went for it played it all recorded it and talked over it and got crazy that's what i did with this video i hope you like it if you don't let me know and if you do like videos like this where i kind of just blather on uncontrolled you know let me know that too because i can do more videos like that it's not a problem So yeah, looks like Puppy Lover and I are kind of traveling close together. We're not really, we're not in a group or anything, but uh, we're just going the same direction. We're headed to base camp too! And hopefully we'll get there soon because I'm getting low on water and uh, that ain't good. That ain't good. You gotta, you gotta stay hydrated. You gotta stay hydrated. Uh-oh, I think the wind's picking up, and it's uh, a little snowstorm coming in. It's getting hard to see. This isn't going to be fun. Looks like i got to walk across a tight rope or something here. All right, I'll let uh, Puppy Lover there take the lead, and I'll just kind of follow behind this looks a little treacherous it's hard to see so uh gosh i hope i don't die that would suck i think i'll hold back here and wait till i know she's for sure across i hope it doesn't i don't think it goofs up the rope if two people are on it but i don't know so i'm just gonna wait Okay, I think she's across. I'm gonna go, 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 go. Let's hope I don't fall and die and break my neck. And, you know, and, and what if I fall, break my neck, didn't die, but nobody knows that I fell and I'm languishing horribly for a couple days in this crevice far below with a broken neck. Ah, I'd probably freeze to death and die. What am I kidding? Wouldn't be days. It'd probably be like an hour. <laughs> ah, life is fragile. Life is fragile. Ouch, I think I just bumped into her or something. I hurt myself. I went from 100 health to 82. What, what happened? I don't understand what happened there. Oh my gosh, another rope. Boy, this is treacherous. This part of the game is a little, uh, it's a little intense. I like it. I like this. This is fun. I, I, I'm sure this game has been around a while. I'm sure people, a lot of people have played it, but I've never done this before. I've never been here before, so this is kind of cool. And I'm a little, I'm a little scared. I'm just a little scared, but it'll be okay. Okay, a uh, real quick shout out. I saw that one of the group followers was in game here there while I was playing. Uh, Cjalcaria095. Little shout out to you. Thanks for popping in the game there. And, uh, I don't know where you went, but looks like you popped back out right away. Oh, well. Tell you what, this rope walking and platform jumping is starting to get on my nerves. I hope I'm getting close to the end. This, it's fun. It's fun. And I'm having a good time. And I'm following Puppy Lover. She's doing a really good job up there ahead. So, that's kind of cool. And, uh, I just, woo! I'll be glad when this part of the... The expedition is over. Holy crap, are you kidding me? Now it's dark out? Oh, wow. See, the problem here is that I know I gotta be getting close to base camp too. And the fall and die at this point, when, you, when you're, when you I'm sure I'm getting close, that would just be a bummer. <laughs> it would be a bummer. It's a game, but still, it'd be a bummer, right, Internet? 
You know it's right. Oh, thank goodness. This is the end. This has to be the end. It is the end. It's the end. I made it. Oh, look at that. There's the base camp up there. I made it. I made it to base camp, too. I was I was getting worried there, guys. I was really getting worried there, internet ladies and gentlemen. Um, yeah, I was afraid I was going to fall and die. And, and I knew I was getting close, but it didn't happen. I made it. And uh, it was really cool traveling there the last past five, ten minutes, whatever it was with Puppy Lover. That was pretty neat. So shout out to her, too, if she sees this video. All right, made it to the end. There's the victory circle checkpoint. We'll let her hit it first, and then I'll hit it. All right, Internet, thanks for watching. I hope you checked out the entire video. And if you did, and if you haven't, I hope you like and subscribe and you share and you comment. And don't forget, um, like I said, I'm thinking of doing a question and answer video here in the near future. So jot down some questions below in the comments and let me know. And uh, we'll see what happens. We'll go from there. So uh, I uh, hope you guys liked the video, and I'll catch you on the next, next one. Thanks for watching, Internet.